We, the world's least developed countries, have come to the Climate Action Summit with a clear vision for a climate resilient future. Our vision is for all of the least developed countries to deliver climate resilient development pathway by 2030 and net zero emission by 2050. Our nations are home to 1 billion people. We are the most affected by the climate emergency, although we have done little to create the problem. We requested the Climate Action Summit and we believe world leaders should increase their ambition and support for climate action. We want to be a progressive members of the global community. We want to be the leaders in tackling the climate emergency and inspire others to do so. Over the last two years, we have been developing our vision for a climate resilient future. We have worked with more than 600 experts from around the world to launch the Least Developed Countries Initiative for Effective Adaptation and Resilience. This initiative charts an effective, ambitious response to the climate challenge with all countries and communities from the least to the most vulnerable working hand in hand for a climate resilient future. Together with our other initiatives, the LDC Initiative for Renewable Energy and Energy Efficiency and the University Consortium on Climate Change, the LDC Group has a strong package ready to help us deliver on our 2050 vision. Our goal is to see our people living in just, inclusive, happy and poverty-free societies. To develop economies that are low carbon and prosperous with vibrant and sustainable growth within ecological limits. We want to see landscapes and ecosystems that are sustainably managed, less vulnerable to climate shocks and stresses and that use nature-based solutions. We have been taking actions, now it's time to scale up these efforts. We expect the same from the international community to join together with us and to address the challenge of climate change. We are committed to low carbon climate resilient development. Despite being the most vulnerable to climate risks, we are working to develop a more effective, ambitious climate response. At this summit, we are making five ambitious commitments to achieve our 2050 vision. We will, number one, work with the whole of society to achieve a low carbon, climate resilient future. Number two, develop strong climate finance architecture with at least 70% of the financial flow supporting local level actions by 2030. Number three, integrate adaptation, mitigation and resilience into our national and local development objectives. Number four, we'll strengthen our climate capabilities, institutions, knowledge, skills and learning. Number five, we will create more inclusive governance of climate decisions, ensuring they are centered on gender transformation and social justice. To reach these critical goals, we are asking for your support. We ask you, number one, to provide high quality, predictable and accessible finance to help us deliver the SDGs and Paris Agreement with a shared goal of at least 70% of the financial flow supporting local level actions by 2030. Number two, we ask you to work together to reduce transaction costs and ensure mutual accountability behind LDC leadership. Number three, we ask you to work with us in the long term to strengthen our national and local institutional capabilities. And number four, invest in our climate resilient net zero economies and technologies. Lastly, we ask you to develop your own ambitious strategies for 1.5 degree low carbon climate resilient pathway by 2020. We have shown and we will continue to show our leadership in tackling climate change. We are increasing our ambition with our capacity 
and we invite everyone to increase the ambition for climate action and support. Our offer to you is bold. We, the least developed countries of the world, are united in our will to pursue our vision of a resilient world by 2050. We ask you to join us and support us as we tackle this global emergency.